What's going on everybody? Kenny Ducey here from the Action Network, ready to give you my two favorite plays for Wednesday's NBA slate. This is Daily Action Picks. Now, the two plays are going to come from the same game. I'm looking at the Milwaukee Bucks versus the Memphis Grizzlies. Memphis going into Milwaukee, getting six points. This was six and a half late last night. And I am all over the Grizzlies here at plus six. When you look at this matchup, the Grizzlies on the road, 15 and five against the spread. For comparison's sake, they're 15 and 10 against the spread at home, so much better on the road. And the Milwaukee Bucks have been pretty dreadful in Milwaukee, eight and 14 against the spread. They also come in losers of four of their last six games. And in those six games, they had to play without Drew Holiday. Now they did have to play without some other key members of the backcourt and on the wing, Pat Connaughton and Grayson Allen, you name them. But really, when you look at this team, it's just been a very flat run offensively. 22nd in points scored for 100 possessions over that run. And while Drew Holiday, if he does come back here, should provide a little bit of a jolt, the Bucks still have slipped just to the fringe of the top 10 defensive rating over that time. They could be playing better on that end. And they also don't rebound the ball very well. They're 23rd in rebounding rate this year. Memphis is one of the best rebounding teams in the league. They're top five in rebounding rate. And that's because they have a guy by the name of Steven Adams. Wherever Steven Adams goes, teams will excel in rebounding. Now, I really think that this is a tough matchup for Milwaukee. I think he's going to play good interior defense, unlike some of the last few opponents on Giannis Antetokounmpo and Bobby Portis and stop some of the slashers from getting to the rim. He's also going to control the narrative on the glass very much and steal some extra possessions for Memphis. I, I just don't really love the matchup for Milwaukee, especially at home where they've struggled. And because of that, I'm also going to be on the under 47 and a half points, rebounds, assists for Giannis Antetokounmpo. This is a Memphis Grizzlies team over the last two weeks. They're top five in defensive efficiency, and I don't expect a lot of points coming from Milwaukee. With that, I don't think Giannis racks up the, the assists. I don't think he racks up the points against a strong post defense. And rebounds, we already just mentioned, should come at a premium. So I think that this is a great way to sell high on Giannis Antetokounmpo here. You get the added bonus of Drew Holiday coming back and maybe taking some shots away from Giannis. I think if Holiday comes back, maybe we like the Grizzlies plus six just a little bit less, but we love the points, rebounds, assists under a little bit more. And Holiday doesn't come. I still think that prop can cash. And now there's a, you have a great number on Memphis which is a very, very hot team right now. They had an 11-game winning streak snapped over the weekend. They're rolling. They're playing incredible defense. I think this is going to be a really close game, and Memphis pulls it out on the road, makes it a very close one, one possession game, and they pull out the cover and continue on their hot run. That's it for me. You can check out plenty of our amazing content on actionnetwork.com on the Action Network app. You can follow me on Twitter, at Kenny Ducey. What you can also do is you can like this video if you really, really think that the Memphis Grizzlies cover the six points. And you can like it if you don't think they're going to cover the six points. But please feel free. I will be in the comments section if you'd like to discuss this one. And I'll tell you all about how Memphis is going to cover and you're crazy. But feel free to leave a comment as well. That's it for me. And we'll see you next week.